After three years of renovating and repairing my boat in Oriental, we're finally ready. We're about to push off on March 15th. We've got a big plan to sail almost 7,000 nautical miles to Ireland. We're planning on sailing from Oriental, North Carolina, probably up the ICW to Norfolk, and then to New York City, and then to Newport, Rhode Island, and then up the coast to Boston. From there, we'll go offshore to Lunenburg, Nova Scotia. I've sailed there before. Then offshore again to St. John's, Newfoundland. And then just over a thousand miles up to Nook in Greenland. And I've got about 30 days planned to sail through the fjords of the coast of Greenland. It's really treacherous waters right off the southern tip of Greenland. It would be bad for any boats to get within a hundred miles of the southern tip because the weather is just so bad there. So our plan is to actually sail through these little fjords right at the tip there and come out the eastern side. From there, 650 nautical miles to Iceland. And then another over a thousand nautical mile sail to Kinsale, Ireland. And we're about to push off and the boat's ready. We've got this big plan. This time we've got really professional level video and audio equipment. I've got this big Pelican case mounted on the cabin top in the cockpit with four different video cameras in there so that we can have quick and easy access to grabbing a camera and filming anything that's going on. I've also got a remote controlled quadcopter that holds a camera. So we're going to try to get some footage from the sky <coughs> flying this little quadcopter around. It can go hundreds of feet up into the air, about 15 minutes of flight time. I'm most excited about using that in Greenland to get footage of icebergs, and in Iceland to get footage of live volcanoes. What I really want to do is tell stories of offshore voyaging. I think a big part of that is having interesting people aboard. We've got this other crew, Ina, who I sailed on, uh, on, on Fiona, Eric Forsyth's Fiona uh, from Ireland to Portugal. He's joining us in Boston and is going to sail with us all the way back to uh, Kinsale, Ireland, where he's from. We're going to film nonstop the whole voyage and finally get to Ireland where my plan is to get installed in a marina and then probably spend the next three to six months in full-time around-the-clock editing of these episodes. I really give, you know, the editing is the most time-consuming part. Sometimes I figure that like for every 30 seconds of a final video in, in the episodes that I've made, I put in like 100 hours. It's really time-consuming. And I think unless you're really just passionate about this kind of thing, it would just be way too much work, but, but uh, I'm really enjoying it. When we reach the different ports, I'm going to try to take little snippets of the best footage that we've accumulated so far and make little sort of preview videos and put them up on our YouTube channel. My girlfriend Monique is writing this wonderful blog about our voyaging. And uh, we're at youtube.com slash drinkparagon, also on Facebook, and this is the website address for Monique's blog <coughs> about our voyaging.